we have with us uh, Mr. Amitav Sharma ji, who has uh, delivered this game successfully. I say that delivered successfully means today we are at the closing ceremony, and guest or chairman uh, who was present today has officially declared that the games are closed. So I think officially his duties got over, but it was a uh, still there are long pending work. Maybe must be waiting for him, but. Uh, Let's start from the beginning and uh, let's have an experience that what he felt about this and how did he, what challenges and what was his overall experience about the games. Amitabh ji, please. Well, uh, at the outset, I would like to congratulate Maharashtra by saying Jai Maharashtra for this beautiful cup which is right on my left side. This is a legacy of uh, the Olympic movement in India. Uh, the Raja Bhalendra Singh Trophy, which is a rolling trophy for the best state whoever wins the maximum number of gold medals in every national games. And I'm glad that Maharashtra has emerged as a winner, breaking a streak for past four uh, events, four editions. And uh, congratulations to you, Namdevji. And I also congratulate the chef de mission of the Maharashtra team, uh, Mrs. Yadav, who was just stupendous. I remember, I still remember having CDM meetings and uh, she was so meticulously planning for her athletes. Uh, I still remember the emails asking for the betterment of the athletes, additional support staff, etc, etc. So that shows the professionalism that uh, the team Maharashtra always had. And I think the result is right here in front of us. Uh, the games have been really great, electrifying. It's been a, a historical games, the biggest ever uh, in terms of uh, the athlete numbers. We've got 10,152 athletes who have uh, participated. That is the unique athletes. In total, the number of events and registrations has been 11,170 plus. So that shows that it's been just the magnitude of the games has just been really, really big. 43 sports. Yes, it was a big challenge. Uh, my sincere gratitude to the government of Goa, to the Honorable Chief Minister of Goa, Dr. Pramod Savanji, and the most energetic sports minister that I've ever met, Sri Govan Gaudeji, who has, uh, with his team, Secretary of Sports, Madam Swachita Sachan, uh, ED Sports, Dr. Geeta Nagvenkar, and the entire team of SAG, who did just re who relentless effort to make it a grand success. The takeaway of these games would be that, yes, if there is a will to deliver a great competition, like what we are talking about, India being a superpower in the, in the near future, We've had a great medal haul in the uh, previous Asian Games, the biggest medal tally of 107, which is showing that India is ready. And it's very uh, soon going to be a force to reckon with in the sports uh, uh, arena. Our Honorable Prime Minister, who just announced one month back that India is ready to bid for the 2036 Olympics, just shows that how India is going to emerge into a super power of sports and the entire sporting diaspora of India. It's congratulations to them. These games are a tribute to them. And uh, my thanks, my congratulations to every participant, every contingent member from the CDMs to the deputy CDMs to the president of the State Olympic Association, presidents of the uh, uh, national federations, the secretary generals of the Olympic associations and the national federations. Their effort has been mammoth. I have been, I've had the privilege to have interacted with them over the past four to five months on a personal basis, hearing them, trying to, you know, solve the problems, whatever, if there were any, they were minor. But it has just been a big effort which snowballed into this magnitude and that's where the success stands. So my, once again, my congratulations to each and every stakeholder who has been here either playing or as an administrator or as a support staff. And thank you very, very much for the 37th edition of the National Games. Look forward to see everyone, I don't know in what capacity, in the next edition in 38th. And I'm sure uh, the benchmark has been set. So Uttarakhand is going to maybe go higher than that. And we all eagerly await to the 38th edition very soon. Thank you very much. Few word of Maharashtra Olympic Association and all these hard work. Sir. Yes, please. Maharashtra Olympic Association has just, as I just mentioned, I see the professionalism in Maharashtra Olympic Association. The biggest medal haul for the National Games, it's just uh, amazing. Your athletes, and the best part is that the entire athlete base from the various disciplines and sports that were played here, 
there was a contribution and there was a participation in all of them. So that goes a big mile. That goes a real, real big mile. The diligence shown by the entire administration for the Maharashtra Olympic Association is absolutely exemplary. I still remember those photo finishes where it is either Madhya Pradesh or whether it is either the Services Sports Control Board, you know, missing the medal with a whisker. I still remember the joys with you, the joys with uh, your CDM and, uh, you know, those moments of little low when you miss that gold just by a little bit of a fraction was electrifying. But my kudus to you, to the entire uh, uh, sporting fraternity from Maharashtra, I happened to meet uh, the Honorable Sports Minister from Maharashtra today, hearing his views and the way you want to take the Olympic movement ahead in the state of Maharashtra. I think that is all what is required in the sporting diaspora for excellence here. Thank you very much, sir. And we are looking forward. Hope your support in a Maharashtra in a big way. You have a great Absolutely. experience today. And we together can build up our Indian national team in a future Olympic <coughs> Certainly. Games. Maharashtra would like to extend our hands. Thank you very Thank much. Thank you so very much. One last token. We have dropped it here. We have a Team Maharashtra, Jai Maharashtra, if we can. Absolutely. So that is Team Maharashtra, Jai Maharashtra. That, absolutely. And that is the slogan. And I remember, I would uh, still remember, uh, you know, this being, I was at the archery event. And there was this very close match going between Maharashtra and Jharkhand, if I'm not mistaken. And yes, Maharashtra won the gold there also. So, Jai Shivaji, Jai Maharashtra. That was the slogan which I was, you know, hearing all the time. And my very best to you. Thank you very Great. much, Amitabh ji. I think uh, we have seen, I have been to uh, many games. I played national games myself and uh, been to national games, worked for the national games. Being a friend, he was always supportive. We require a such kind of GTC chairman who understand the issues of SOA. We understand issues of NSA. We understand he works closely with DOCs. I think that is what gesture is required from IOA. And I think Amitabh ji has set up an example. Today, every DOC you ask, every NSF you ask, every State Olympic Association you ask, every CDM you ask, they said, yes, Amitabh was really great and helpful man. and. He has never said no. He tried his level best to support athletes, officials, coaches, and as much as. And of course, I have seen that how did he drive this Goa movement? I think it was very difficult task which has been brought up. He himself is uh, coming from the one of the winter sports. There was a talks in IOA that is leading winter sports and how you're going to handle this summer sports. But I think everything has changed the, the views of the people. And today. He has delivered a long-awaited 37 national games uh, to India. I, I think it's a great gift. So thank you very much once again, Amitabh. Thank you very much for for your uh, the support uh, towards the Maharashtra contingent also. As we came with the largest contingent in in the in the in these uh, uh, games, and we have a lot of support staff. We have a lot of media team. We have a uh, physiotherapist extra. There are so many things, but you know. Uh, Amitabh ji has very clear with us and I think it's not only athletes playing, the whole ecosystem play behind him and uh, for that we need a support and I think I think being a GTCC chairman has guided us and supported us and it is trophy, I think I consider that a lot of guidance and support and contribution of Amitabh ji is here because today we have just to, we as a first stage after four years the Maharashtra has win this trophy. I was, was just talking to SSBC. And I told we are all our rivers and ultimately we are going to be in a sea. Sea is that, that is the Indian team. And I think, you know, we small, small river, Maharashtra, Madhya Pradesh, Haryana, services, our river and going to be combined in IOA, where IOA is going to lead our Indian team in a future Olympic Games. We hope that with this great support of uh, National Games Organizing Committee, if we can deliver a great Olympians in the future in Paris Olympic Games, I think our mission will be successful. Correct. So thank you once again, all of you, and uh, thank you, Amitabh ji, for your support. Thank you very much. Looking forward to see you soon. Pleasure. In Maharashtra, you are from Mumbai, so <laughs> please visit. I have a small stint in Mumbai. <laughs> I am from Himachal, but yes. <laughs> thank you very much.